When Nvidia highlights came to PUBG, I made a video showing how you guys can enable it. You guys can check out that video via hitting the card that just appeared in the top right hand corner of the screen. But today I'm going to be going over reasons why you should not use Nvidia highlights feature on PUBG. Let's go ahead and jump straight into it, guys. Number one, the feature actually reduces in game FPS. Now, before anyone goes and says, of course, you're using Shadow Play, it would. I actually did some testing with MSI Afterburner and just testing in general, and I actually came to the conclusion that even with Shadow Play running, I did a test where I just ran Shadow Shadow play and under the options of the game I had Nvidia highlights turned off under the options of PUBG and the game actually ran smoother and I gained five to six more FPS with the with it turned off under the options of the game so the feature in the options of the game is actually reducing some of the FPS going on to the next thing the overall video quality of what you get is even more compressed than normal shadow play quality which is a giant big issue because with YouTube and stuff like that even when just showing clips to friends and stuff you want to show that oh you know I got this kill that was really far away Way, where they're not going to be able to see the guy that you just shot at or killed because of the reason being that it's going to be more blurry or pixelated than normal shadow play on top of that the overall video file itself actually lags and skips and jumps frame rates sometimes which makes no sense at all because while i'm playing the game it's perfectly buttery smooth now if i were to not use the feature and instead just use regular shadow play from geforce experience there's no lag there's no issues there's no stuttering in the video file or anything along those lines i'm not the only one to report these issues so i know it's not my pc and that my pc can't handle it the next thing after that is just in general most of the time it just doesn't want to work and that's what it comes down to is a lot of people are expecting oh I'm going to go ahead and enable this feature and I expect it to record every single one of my kills and every single one of my deaths the reality is you enable this feature in half the games it doesn't even work no matter if you're up to date on the most recent Nvidia driver or anything it just doesn't want to work and that's the issue so in the end your result doing the thing you didn't want to do in the first place which is hitting alt and f10 to use shadow play to record your most recent kill which won't even work because the feature of PUBG is taking over shadow play so you can't automatically record sometimes so overall what is my recommendation to do well just simply use the normal Nvidia GeForce experience shadow play instead of having it record 10 minutes though go ahead and set it to record the last minute and then every time you get a kill hit alt f10 it's a lot better and you always know it's gonna record when you hit alt f10 most of the time sometimes it doesn't do it but you don't have to rely on this feature in the game that doesn't work half the time that also has lesser video quality that also may have a corrupted video file or on top of that has really laggy video files which makes no sense at all and reduces your in-game fps that's it i hope you guys enjoyed the video and i'll see you guys next time